Wow. Now, this is the thing, right? Mm-hmm. Before we even get into that, the first thing I think is how many more situations is like that out there? Mm-hmm. It, you know what I'm saying? This hasn't been caught yet. Mm-hmm. There has to be more. I'm just telling you. Like, yeah, that's the, uh, that's the thing. You know how I feel, man. When I come into <laughs> power, the first thing I'm going to ban <laughs> is interracial adoption. No, I'm kidding. But I always look at that kind of funny because it's like – if I if I'm one of the people that um, works with people to adopt children and stuff, and you come in, you're a white couple, and you're like, "Oh, we would love a black baby." Like, why the hell do you want a black kid? Yeah, that's a fair question. <laughs> <laughs> that's, a, that's a fair question. Um, yeah, it's uh, it's this is a thing. How do you? How do you? Adoption is tricky. Like, but how do you truly ensure that the children are safe, whether it's interracial or same race, whatever? Because um, I was some it was some uh, story I heard about where there was a white family and and the mom um was starving the kids and keeping them in the closet or something like that mm-hmm. and stuff like that. So I, I think it goes on everywhere, of course, um, or all races, um, because there's some you know I'm sure there's some black people who don't treat their kids right, right? Mm-hmm. The thing is, how in this day and age and technology and everything what are they doing to ensure that people are truly safe right uh, you would think that they would like have uh more checkups and stuff like that right yeah people, like really come by maybe like once a month twice a month to check on the kids but then again i guess they need like a safe word or something like <laughs> you know what i'm saying <laughs> like they ain't gonna come out and just be like hey they're treating me like a slave. They, it got to be something. They, gotta, they need one of them life alert buttons or something like, you but, know. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing. They're supposed to um kind of talk to the kids one-on-one to make sure everything's okay. Mm. But I don't know. I don't think they do that sometimes. Sometimes they just probably just want to get the kids out or whatever. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's it's sad, though. It's definitely sad. Hopefully, um, the more things like this, if this is happening in other places, it gets exposed. Yeah, for sure. And we'll definitely... um those people as we as their stories come across our desk hope they don't get out right for real hope it hope they stay in jail for life um this week was a big week for the president they debated oh man it was um uh, uh oh i'm sorry i'm acting like joe biden 